why the TikTok ban is so dangerous. The app faces scrutiny over the way its algorithm selects content on sensitive and contentious issues like the Israel-Hamas war. How about it? So really, the powers that be aren't happy with its algos. It's like you need more like YouTube algos that really filter stuff out. Here you have the, the AstroTurf opponents to the bill, all with the same sign, same font, everything. Opponents to the bill say the ban raises free, free, free speech concerns. You know, maybe that's misdirection, maybe not. ByteDance, uh, just so we're clear on ByteDance, it's a Chinese outfit, would have less than six months from the enactment of the bill to divest TikTok. You'll see the significance of six months in a minute, or the app will be banned from app stores and web hosting services in the U.S. So six month time frame to shut down or sell. And Biden said he's going to sign the bill if it gets to his desk. Undoubtedly, he will. This. So let's look who owns ByteDance. ByteDance is owned 20% by its founders and Chinese. So we have 20% Chinese investment. We have 20% is owned by the employees. And 60% is owned by a group of, of essentially U.S. LBO and private equity firms, uh, including KKR. So the big bad Chinese here are not are not Chinese, they're KKR. So you're talking about a company that, that is owned and essentially controlled by, you know, a group of four or five of, of huge American LBO and private equity firms. So the notion that this is somehow a Chinese company is ridiculous. The push to destroy free speech is as strong as the push to destroy the Second Amendment. So, and these things are conditions precedent to getting the control grid to work. I, 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 right now, the push to, to put to destroy free speech is stronger. Yes, I agree. It, this, there, there is a war. The, the real war, Catherine, in my opinion, is over minds. 